Hey, how y'all doing? All right, give it up for all the comics y'all seen so far. Isn't this a great show? You guys are getting your money's worth tonight, right? Shit is free, so everything's funny. I'm just happy to be here. I had to get out the dang house. I actually switched careers to become a comedian. Don't ever do that. The money is not the same. And when you notice your checking account dive, you gotta be strategic, you gotta cut stuff off. You gotta figure out what can stay and what can go. So I cut off my homeowner's insurance, then I cut off my house alarm, then I called the cops and reported my boyfriend as a potential domestic terrorist. So now the feds watch my house for free. I have never felt safer. You gotta be resourceful when your money changes. <laughs> and you notice everything too. I notice all the wasteful spending in the government, you know, because everything gets on your nerves when you start losing money. Y'all realize we pay for Secret Service for the lifetime of a president? We are still paying for round the clock Secret Service for Jimmy Carter. This man is 96, down in Atlanta, peanut farming, ain't bothering no damn body who is after <laughs> Jimmy Carter. <laughs> Don't nobody remember what Jimmy Carter looked like. He is, we can take that out of the budget. <laughs> then they said it costs millions of dollars to execute a criminal. Why is it that expensive? I know I can do this cheaper, you know. <laughs> Get a 1977 Pinto in an old garage, put him in the back seat, turn the carbon monoxide, gone. $42.86. <laughs> My name is Alicia Cooper and I approve this message. <laughs> and we have messed up, y'all. Do y'all realize that any one of us could have been the president this year? <laughs> this, <laughs> this was a good ass year to run. And y'all sat on y'all asses, going to comedy clubs, not giving a shit about this country, and let these two people be the last damn two. This don't make no sense. We not even voting because we excited. We voting because we hate the other one more. What kind of shit is this? I'm getting out of my bed because I hate. When did this become a reason to vote? This is too damn much. Hillary Clinton boy now, Hillary messing up. This chick knows she's sick. Hillary coughing up there, Fox News ain't shit. They, they sat up there and ran a bunch of clips of Hillary coughing. That was the funniest thing I ever saw. <laughs> they spliced together every time this woman coughed and I was laughing. All we needed was a soundtrack underneath. <laughs> then she was sick and didn't tell nobody, so she falls out on 9-11. Somebody had a meme with a shoe on the ground with the hashtag never forget. <laughs> and it was the ugliest damn shoe. You know that wasn't Hillary's shoe. I said, you know what y'all are doing too damn much. Fox News reported that her, her van really has a lift in the back for a wheelchair. And that they not showing the American people. I was laughing my ass off. My Uber driver, some Uber drivers are very judgmental. She gonna tell me she can't vote for Hillary because she can't vote for a woman with low self-esteem. And I said, why does she have low self-esteem? She like, she didn't leave Bill when he cheated on her for Monica. And she was like, and I left all my husbands for less. And I was like, yeah, bitch, but you driving for Uber. Husband. You might be at Lyft by now. Yeah. I gave her two stars. That's how much she pissed me off. I gave her two stars with that BS she talking. 